we continue to track a tropical wave out in the Atlantic. It's a very disorganized system. Still no center of circulation, but the hurricane hunters will be going to investigate later on this afternoon. But ahead of the system, there's very warm waters and little wind shear. So the thinking is that the storm system will become a tropical storm over the next 24 hours or so. And as a result, the hurricane center now has issued potential tropical cyclone nine. So it hasn't formed yet. That's why it's the potential, but it is likely to happen as it approaches the Le the Leeward Island. So here's what the, the forecast is calling for. But again, there's so much uncertainty in the long term, but we'll explain as it approaches the Leeward Island, it could become a tropical storm. Then once it approaches Cuba and Haiti and uh, the, the basically Hispaniola and Puerto Rico, there's going to be some drier air and some wind shear, which will likely help to weaken the storm system. Plus, it's going to interact with land and the models do take it closer to Bermuda as we head towards the weekend. So certainly a storm system that we have to watch. But in the longer range, we're, we're, there's very little confidence in where it is going because some computer models do curve it out to see some do bring it closer to the peninsula. But at this point in time, Sunday, that's when we can start to see some heavy rain and some stronger winds. But again, the computer models do keep the storm system on the weaker side right around tropical storm level with winds at about 50 miles an hour.